Hello everybody, my name is Nico. Happy New Year! It's 2020, I realize that I'm a week and a half late, but better late than never. That's the, uh, that's the kids are saying now, right? Right? No? No one? Okay. The reason I'm making this video today is because I, I kind of want to address what I'm doing on YouTube because for a year, give or take, I've been on and off doing videos, but never consistently. It's always been, I do something for a second and then I stop for months and then I start up again. And this year I really want to do better about that because I have three New Year's resolutions this year, or it's one split into three parts. Uh, positivity, presence, and persistency are my three goals for the year. So the positivity, pretty straightforward, pretty self-explanatory, I think. I just want to, and the concept of PMA is not new, positive mental attitude, but it's something that I tried a little bit to work on last year. Didn't make it most of the time, so I'm trying to step it up this year, and I'm trying to be less flamboyantly positive and more just like, accepting of things that happen and just rolling with it. Presence, as far as that goes, um, I want to be, I, I want to experience the moment more when I'm with people, when I'm surrounded by people. So when I go out to like hang out with friends, the phone stays in the car or in the pocket instead of, you know, being used. Uh, I just want to be there rather than doing something else. Like, especially if I'm just out with people I haven't seen in a while. And the third one, and the reason that I'm here on the internet, uh, persistency. I want... Anyone who knows me knows that my ability to commit to anything long-term could use some work. And this is going to be the year that I try to do that. Because making videos is fun and I enjoy it, but I want to, more than anything, prove to myself that I can set up a schedule, that I can maintain a consistent and regular, like, upload schedule. Like, I want to share these games with people. I want to be like, because these are games that I enjoy playing. And so if I can share my experiences, my positivity with people who are willing to sit for an hour and listen to me yell at zombies, for instance, then that's great. But more than anything else, this, I'm here mainly for me. I want to show myself that I can do this, that I can commit to something and, you know, be persistent and consistent about it. This channel will never hit a thousand subscribers. I'll be surprised if it is a hundred. I barely know that many people. Like if it does, I won't complain. It's just, I, that is not the point. That's not why I'm here. I am here because I need to prove to myself that I can be, you know? So that's that's why I'm here. And I've had a few people ask me, are you a creator now? Are you like making content? And I'm just like, yes, technically, but also no, not really. Because I, I feel like YouTube's glory days, the golden age of uploading and becoming a creator, um, I feel like those days are over and people at the top are at the top and people at the bottom might move up to the middle, but that's about it until the next phase comes by and people start rocking it up in popularity <clears throat> and people start rocking it fuck, and people start rocking it up rock oh, and people start getting popular because those trends get popular. But I am okay with not ever being one of those people. I currently have a day job. I dropped my hours down recently because I wanted to be able to commit more to this. So I only work in the mornings now, leading me to have free time in the afternoons to work on this stuff. Stuff that I feel is evolving me as a person. Maybe even in just subtle ways. Maybe just this whole experience will be, will be what changes something in my mind that leads me to make something happened with my life because right now I, I feel I've felt very stagnant in life. I graduated from university more than two years ago and I still live at home with my mom. <laughs> uh, my brother leaves for college in six months. 
or seven months, I guess. And my goal is to move forward because I work in an environment. It's it's not negative in and of itself, but I there are a few people around me who are just maybe not OK with where they are, but satisfied. And it it it's led to me getting into this bubble of I am where I am, this is where I have been, this is where I will be, and there's no reason for me to change that. And over the last several months, I don't know what's happened specifically, but I I need to move on. I need to get out of there. I am I'm ready. I'm ready to go. <laughs> so that's that's what 2020 is going to pan out to be. And this is why I'm here and doing this, I'm trying to be consistent about it. It's not I could do better. Already I've missed several days. Like the first few days after New Year's, I was already like messing up. But I plan and hope to improve. I want to do at least one video a day. Every day of the week, all seven days. And some of them will be longer, like Let's Plays like The Last of Us, where I sit down for an hour and record that straight through. Some of them will be shorter, like Beat Saber videos with a level that's only a couple minutes long. But I want to have something at least go up on the channel every day this year from now moving forward. Um, so that's the goal. That's why I'm here. And anyone who's willing to stick with me for this, thank you. Um, but again, this is not, I never, or I don't, I don't foresee YouTube as being my profession. I don't see this as a stable source of income. I don't see this as what I want to quit work to do. Because this is fun, but also fickle. The algorithm is a... The algorithm giveth, and the algorithm taketh away. Uh, and so I, I would rather put my... Put stock into something that's more consistent, more reliable. And see see what I can do with that. But, yeah, that's, that's why I'm here. Anyone who was curious as to why suddenly I'm making videos out of nowhere, now you know. And um, again, happy new year, happy holidays. They're over now, but I hope that everyone had a good time. And uh, yeah, see you in the next one.